It's a whole lot of life. You got a whole lot of cosmic forces. It ain't just the ancestors. It's not just the ancestors. That's what you got to know. And as above, so below. Yes, that's the real thing. Motherfuckers disagree on other planets just like we disagree here. Motherfuckers laugh, joke, experience. Yes, all as above, so below. That's a real thing. Duality is a real thing. It's duality in all things. And if you start getting to the galaxy, you can see where the fuck these reptilians come from. You can see where they come from. And then you got, I mean, it get deeper. I ain't even get into the different councils of light. You got so many different councils of light. Then you got the, the council of nine, which is the original nine goddesses of the original nine divine feminine energies that was created in the beginning out of pure dark matter energy. You got the Galactic Confederation of Light. You got, man, you got so many different light councils. The Andromedans got light councils. The Blue Avians got a couple different light count councils of light. It's just like a never ending. It's so, it's just a vast, it's just a vast conglomerate of beautiful, powerful energies. And at the top is Source. Source created all. And Source is composed of these nine divine feminine energies. I like to call them the Council of Nine. All divine feminine energies. The first nine that manifested themselves out of pure dark matter energy. That's Source. This is why you cannot disrespect the divine feminine energy. You can't. It's Source. And the divine masculine energy is just as important because the, that's the protection. Remember, you can't disrespect the divine masculine energy neither because it was created by the divine feminine energy. So do you think the divine feminine energy wants you to disrespect her creation of divine masculine energy? No. <laughs> they go hand in hand. You see what I'm saying? Because nigga, I take that wrong law with shit. We can treat the divine masculine energy anyway. No, the fuck you cannot. Don't ever forget who designed all this shit. It was the divine masculine energy that did that. Remember now, the divine feminine energy created us. And then told us to be fruitful and multiply, to provide and protect. And we provided by creating all that you see. We started creating the cosmos, the planets, the universes. We start enumerating how many planets it should be, how many multiverses it should be, how many galaxies, how many par parallel dimensions, how many planes of existence should be on each planet. We start creating the number, the supreme mathematic, which is why nine is the highest number. You know, so it's like, that's why the oppressor got us to disrespect both. And that just disconnected us from all our cosmic family to an extent. 